Vegan, let's prove that we have mercy. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Supreme Master Ching Hai appreciatively present Dr. Al Muderis with the Shiny World Compassion Award plus 20,000 US dollars as a humble token of support, if allowed, toward the Refugee Foundation under his care. Thank you for giving so many the gift of happiness through independent mobility by your skilled hands and making our world more aware of the plight of asylum seekers and refugees. May Allah always bless you abundantly. Shining World Compassion Award recipient Dr. Manjed Al Mudaris, orthopedics revolutionary and human rights activist. Continue watching to learn more. Cherished viewers, I don't say means welcome in the Dula language an important native language of the people from Cote d'Ivoire that expresses their respectful and considerate nature. I'm Aruna. The munificent people of Cote d'Ivoire are overjoyed to join hands in bringing hope and happiness to those in need in all corners of the world. Welcome to our program, Shining World Compassion Award recipient Dr. Mujid Al Mudiris, orthopedic revolutionary and human rights activist. Everywhere in the world, we can observe and be touched by acts of kindness. People from all walks of life, faiths, and cultures extend themselves beyond the call of duty to help others unconditionally. Even loving, caring animals also contribute in this noble category. Through their noble deeds, humanity as a whole is elevated. To commend virtuous actions and encourage more people to be inspired by their examples, Supreme Master Ching Hai has lovingly created a series of awards, including the Shining World Leadership Award, Shining World Compassion Award, Shining World Hero and Heroine Awards, Shining World Honesty Award, Shining World Protection Award, Shining World Intelligence Award, and Shining World Invention Award, etc. etc. These awards are to recognize some of the most exemplary, generous, caring, and courageous people who walk amongst us, as well as heroic, beautiful animal co-inhabitants whose acts are worthy of praise and gratitude. Born to a prominent family in Baghdad, Iraq, Dr. Mujid al Muderes first dreamed of becoming a surgeon after watching The Terminator as a boy. Years later, his pursuit was suddenly interrupted by a harrowing event which would change his life forever. While training as a first-year surgery resident in Baghdad, government authorities marched into the hospital and ordered the surgical team to perform a harmful mutilation surgery on vast loads of army deserters or otherwise face certain death. Though fearing for his life following his conscious, Dr. Al Moderas refused orders that would harm others. After fleeing the country on a leaking of a crowded boat traveling over turbulent seas to Australia, Dr. Al Moderas was incarcerated in refugee detention centers for almost a year. Upon release, he immediately continued his unwavering pursuit to become a surgeon. 
Having seen many victims of conflict with missing limbs, Dr. Almadire's dream of someday helping such people was finally realized after 10 years of resettlement when in 2010 he began his career as an orthopedic surgeon. Today, Dr. Al Mudiras is one of the few surgeons in the world who pioneered osseointegration surgery, which takes mobility, functionality, and quality of life for amputees to a new level. In our special interview, the brilliant doctor tells us about this fascinating revolutionary technology. Over the last six centuries, um Amputees have been treated by a socket-mounted prosthesis, which is a, an invention that was made by Ambreas Barre in 1529. This technology hasn't changed over these centuries, and it's basically like a bucket wrapping around the residual limb um, of the amputee, and they walk on it. It's very inconvenient. It causes a lot of skin friction and a lot of excoriation, heat, rash, and blisters and infection. Other problems are mobility and fit, where they they fit in the morning and they may not fit in the evening because of the swelling. And uh, the patient that use this prosthesis usually walk without feeling the ground. So this revolutionary technology that we came up with is um, um, basically by skeletally uh, attaching a titanium uh, high tensile strength rod uh, into the residual skeleton, similar to their alignment of what's normal body is like and then connecting it through a small opening in the skin to a robotic uh, limb and in upper limbs we hook up the nerves uh, with uh, my electric prosthesis so it becomes mind control um, this basically bring amputees as close as possible to uh, being able to walk with normality with a proper gait uh, reduce the skin friction and doesn't have the issue of the mobility and fit and give them the sense and the feedback from the ground so they can feel while they're walking so they don't have to walk um, uh, while looking at the ground and uh, they can walk into dark rooms and they can return back to a uh, high level of uh, functionality and activity. The vast majority of MPTs um, uh, feel that they have their life back. Um, when it comes to above knee MPTs, they get their mobility back. When it becomes to below knee MPTs, for example, they almost have their leg back. Uh, so um, there is nothing more exciting than the smile, the tears of joy uh, that I see on um, the faces of children when they see their parents uh, walk again and um, being able to interact with them in a more natural way. Through his foundation, Dr. Al Maduro's biggest hope is to further develop, expand and share this life-changing technology with the world and to provide help unconditionally to people who need it most. His amazing work was recognized by Queen Elizabeth and Prince Harry, who invited the good doctor on projects to make the procedure become available in Britain. The other um, side of it is by directly going to international destination like developing countries uh, all around the world in Southeast Asia, in, uh, uh, for example, Cambodia, Laos, Vietnam, uh, the Middle East and other places and help people by operating on people in need. Um, and I fund team of people that go there with me. And um, um, also uh, we go and teach uh, other centers in developed world um, where uh, people uh, have the capacity to provide help and um, educate and build centers around the world that can replicate our work. A compassionate ambassador for multiple humanitarian organizations, Dr. Al Mudiris champions for people seeking asylum and refugees, sharing his words of encouragement. The message that I would give to all refugees um, is that when we leave our birth countries, we get detached from our roots, and it may take very long time before we find roots again in the new place that we live in. Um, but uh, what I would recommend is that don't give up, don't lose hope, and don't feel alienated because there will be discrimination. Um, however, the way you deal with it is by um, showing compassion, um, interaction, um, integration, 
assimilation and education. Upon hearing about his humanitarian revolutionary work, Supreme Master Ching Hai appreciatively presented Dr. Al Mudiris the Shining World Compassion Award plus 20,000 US dollars as a humble token of support toward the Refugee Foundation under his care. Dear Dr. Al Mudaris, it is with great admiration and gratitude that we present to you the Shining World Compassion Award for your tremendous contributions to the osseointegration surgery field and for championing the welfare of refugees, hoping to build a more compassionate and caring global community. This award is presented in recognition of your dignified integrity, exemplifying the Hippocratic Oath in service of others. Your care for the oppressed is creating a kinder, love-filled world. Born in Iraq, you were forced to leave due to a firm belief in justice and conscience that could not follow directives against human life. After a decade of challenges as an asylum seeker, in 2010 you started your prestigious career in orthopaedic surgery. Having seen many victims of the conflict in Iraq with missing limbs, you dreamed of helping someday such people become whole again through mechanical replacements, which led you on a mission to be a pioneering osseointegration surgeon in Australia and, ultimately, a world-renowned leader in the field. You've travelled worldwide to impart your brilliant skills and technique, enhancing the lives of countless people through the surgeons you teach. Equally important is your work as a respected humanitarian and human rights advocate, saying, I believe that we are all equal. We are all the same, regardless of our religion, background or colour. Your love has led you on many self-funded missions to heal the body and hearts of traumatised people, rekindling their confidence. For making amputees whole again, creating hope of a brighter future, and for being a courageous, merciful and admirable example of saintly nobility, with the utmost respect, we salute the great compassionate deeds of Dr. Munjid al Madaris. May heaven shower you with abundant love. In Allah's immense love, protection and blessings, Supreme Master Ching Hai. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Thank you. That's beautiful. Supreme Master Ching Hai, thank you very much uh, for this generous donation and for the award. I feel very humbled and very privileged uh, to be uh, chosen to have the award and the recognition. And I can uh, assure you that this will help a lot to uh, pursue goals of helping people in need um, and um, people who cannot afford uh, the treatment and um, this will go further to support the humanitarian cause. Supreme Master Ching Hai is deeply grateful to the beloved God for all the financial help, comfort and support to the afflicted and needy and or any good cause over the years as a humble vessel for his compassion and love toward his precious children. For more information about Dr. Al Mudiris and his work in osseo integration surgery, please visit almudiris.com.au. Our deep gratitude and esteemed regards to Dr. Al Mudiris for your noble heart, tremendous service, and admirable courage, bringing humanity closer to finding hope, healing, and freedom in both the body and soul. May the benevolence bless you and your loved ones forevermore. Supportive viewers, thank you for being with us today on our show. Up next is People Need True strong and wise leaders part one of three on between master and disciples in god's merciful light may the rays of hope shine brightly for all vegan our children will thank us for being kind
Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash SWA. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com barre oblique schedule et suprememastertv.com barre oblique SWA. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com barra inclinada schedule y suprememastertv.com barra inclinada SWA. हमारे कार्यक्रम पेश किए जाते हैं कई भाषाओं में कृपया देखें suprememastertv.com/schedule और suprememastertv.com/swa